centro per Inzaghi, 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 Inzaghi. What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be testing out Inzaghi. We're going to be looking at how he compares to the free version and this premium blue lock collaboration Inzaghi is definitely one of the most impactful players with the new gameplay. So we're going to be diving in and testing him online against Division 1 players, showing you the best build for him, and a secret tip that I think could make this guy really, really meta or super OP. We'll get into it in a second. Let's go. Thanks to Lou, thanks to one of the guys on our stream today, we have got this pack, 1,500 coins. This is what it gets, or this is what it gets you. So you've got Inzaghi with his special little card here, which is the blue lock collaboration, plus three to his stats. We're going to do a train up of this card now as well. He's a goal poacher, 31 levels. Max booster is going to be the blue lock striker's instinct. Max plus three to the attack and awareness, ball control, finishing and acceleration. And to get to maximum effects, you need to have three or more blue lock players. So this is the collaboration that they're doing. I'm going to lock this bad boy up. His booster details are there as well. And this is the content that you get. So you also get an avatar and 40,000 trainers with the blue locked squad squ or kit as well. That's been modeled by Salah. The avatar, if you want to change your avatar, you go to extras, you go to user information, user details, and then you can switch whatever one you want. So there's a selection of real players and legend players. And the ones up here are the ones that we just got here as a background. You can choose two different backgrounds at the top here. I like the red. We'll go with that. And that's what's going to be on when your match makes. Shooting. I'm happy enough with shooting at, 80, 80, at 90, man. 90 finishing. We'll pop. I'd like to pop a lot onto acceleration. Oh, man. This is going to be crazy. Look at, the, look at his attack and awareness. 99. I think we'll go two more. Into that. We'll go 88 speed. 101 attack and awareness, 90 acceleration, 90 finishing, speed 80. I don't think his tight possession is going to matter too much, man, to be honest with you. We'll go with that, and then maybe aerial strength. Now listen, lads, we tested out in Zaggy in multiple, multiple different scenarios against really good sweaty players and Division 1 players, and also when we were getting lots of chances. But essentially, to keep it as simple as possible, once you get a player into these areas... It's all about just being able to have them in those areas. You'll see his position in here of how he stays on side. It's very, very nice. He's going to be kind of moving, shaking. He's like Elvis Presley, man, on the dance floor. He's going to be moving, bopping, all that stuff. Once he gets into these positions, it's all about just being able to just pop the ball in with him. That's all you really need. This is not a run and gun player. This is not Romario where you're going to be spinning defenders, especially with where the gameplay is at the moment. He's also not going to be a target man like Collar. He's kind of just a shoot on sight. It kind of a player that falls through the cracks a little bit. But with the new update, if you do get chances with these guys, you have to be banging them in, man. You genuinely do have to be banging them in as best as you can. And it's with this Inzaghi build, he goes to 100 overall, as you see here. He doesn't play SS, so that's something that you'll have to do with the new position trainer that you can train as well. You get one as a login bonus for the next seven days. Also with the blue lock strikers instinct here, you're going to be getting a plus three. But in order to get that plus three boost to his individual stats, as you saw in his stat base here, you are going to have to have two other players minimum in the squad. Whether it's Kubo, whether it's the free player that you got, like Hoyland or any of them, or Moteng. But that's how he compares to the free version of him. So that's his free version. They're both goal poachers, both the exact same height, weight. Obviously, the young uh, Inzaghi is slightly quicker, I think. Ball control is way better on the premium version, 87. 90 finish in each, heading 85 each. Curl is better. Speed is actually better on the younger Inzaghi. Kick and power is the same. Jump is better on the other Inzaghi. Balance is the same. Stamina is better on the premium Inzaghi. And then these are the current effects that you have here because we've only got two players. This Inzaghi has super sub as well. Now, lads, we have kind of split up this video as well. I did a lot of this during the live stream, but I would definitely encourage you to train him like this if you can with the player skills and also with the stats that we showed at the start with the player build one hidden tip that i've also said about inzaghi is to give him long range curler a lot of people don't expect you to shoot with players like this because they're not as run and gun his acceleration is is kind of half the battle here with inzaghi right you want him to be popping up and making brilliant runs and that's going to be affected by his attack and awareness if you can get that to as close to 100 as possible while still having a long range kind of like weapon there that you can have in your arsenal 
you will be able to pop a lot of shots in where people won't be expecting it. You will notice if you're playing against a really good division guy, it's very rare that they press you once you get into their final third. In division 3, 4, 5, people will kind of kamikaze defend you and they let the AI defend a little bit as well. But as things tighten up when you go up and you start to push rank, you need to be able to shoot from distance. Even if you're not going to be scoring a lot of chances, this is definitely one tip I would say. In Zaggy, a lot of people will view him as kind of like a slower based player that's not running gun like Romy, Romario, Mbappe, Free Santos, Neymar, any of those guys, right? And also he's not the tallest, but I do like aerial superi superiority on him because he does have heading as well. First time shot and one touch pass he has off the rip. So definitely outside curler and long range curler will add to him in a big, big way. Whatever else you throw on him as your fifth skill, that's up to you guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, lads. It's a bit different. Let me know what you think. So lads, honestly, right, I think there's two types of players now, as I covered in the video, just as a final thought. There's players that you start with as your main starting 11 guys, and if they're not, you know, your plan A, if they're not doing it for you, you need to have somebody that can come in and shake up your tactics, your formation, and if your opponent is too comfortable in how he's defending you, you can have an impact player. And I think Inzaghi is definitely in the top five impact players in the game. He's got super sub off the rip, a little bit of investment into him. He can be a beast for you with his positioning, but he is a slower based player. So he's not really a run and gun player, even with that high acceleration. But yeah, it's hard to recommend a player that costs 1500 coins because it depends on how much value you place on that 1500 coins. So I do be always kind of like, like to test these cards out fully. I hope those clips helped you out. And of course we will be streaming as well. But for me, I'm going to say that at the moment, if you have a plan B, Inzaghi can be a monster, but so can Collar, so can Giroud, so can these players that you bring in once you change your system. Let me know if you actually got this Inzaghi. Of course, you get trainers with him as well. For me, I would say that you can get by without getting him, but let me know what you guys think. Do you agree or disagree? How has he been banging the goals in for you if you have got him? Don't forget to subscribe if you like the content. 